Introduction to Numbers from 31 to 40 Hello children, in the previous video we learnt numbers from 21 to 30 and read those numbers as units and tens. In this video, we will see some interesting examples of reading numbers from 31 to 40 and reading those numbers as units and tens. Today, Chotu went to buy pencils from the market. Let us see what he is doing with it now. Now I have lot of pencils with me. I will count all the pencils. Firstly, here is a box of pencils with 10 pencils, that is 1 tenth. Then I took another pencil box containing 10 more pencils, meaning 1 more tenth. After that, another pencil box containing 10 pencils, which means 1 more tenth. So children, can you tell me how many pencils Chotu has? Come on, let us see. I have three groups of ten pencils, which means three tens, that is thirty pencils. And here are my five old pencils. So thirty pencils meaning thirty units with five more pencils, so five units more. Children, can you tell me how many pencils does Chotu have now? Come on, let's see. Chotu had 30 pencils, followed by 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. So Chotu has 35 pencils in total. In 35 pencils, 3 means 3 tens and 5 means 5 units, which means total 35 pencils. After some time, Chotu's mother found some more of his pencils. Chotu, see I have got five more of your pencils. Keep these together as well. Okay, mummy. I had 35 pencils and now five pencils more. And that means five units more. After 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. So now I have 40 pencils. Yes, Chotu, you are right. How many tens do you have now? Mummy, 40 pencils meaning I have 4 tens, isn't it, Mummy? And units? Mummy, there are no units in 40. Yes, Chotu, there are only 4 tens in 40 and 0 units. So children, that was all for today. In this video, we saw numbers from 21 to 40 and some interesting examples of reading those numbers as units and tens. In the next video, we will see some interesting examples of numbers from 21 to 40 and learn about some common mistakes which should not be done. Till then, goodbye friends.